but I like it. Can you hear me good? I meant well. Yeah, well done. <laughs> Although the buzzing is not showing up on the recording last time, it didn't show up. Oh, you didn't see me too? I thought you said you had nothing or seen. What you just deleted? What notes did you delete? I ain't gonna read nothing. It went to a different note. It wasn't, it did it. But, um, no, just, this is the only thing I got. I wasn't, I ain't mean seen two. I been seen five. Oh my gosh. mean I need to place whatever you about to say. Because I just completely, I was just completely. Fuck it. Go ahead. What Continue. Doing? So Kenya has another confessional. Back I have no notes. I'm gonna be winging this. I did watch it, but I did not have time to type. So I do not think to say. But go ahead. Sheree is arriving to the venue. Right. I think earlier I might have said pre-show scene two or something. No, that wasn't no pre-show. That was just showing up to the venue to see how the venue looks. This is the motherfucking pre-show. Right. This is the pre-show. This is the pre-show. It's yes. gorgeous. Hello. Look at you. Oh, you Thank you. You do too. Hey. <laughs> you finally made it to oh this Oh my point. gosh. We are here. Yes, honey. Okay, so I see everything's coming together. Yeah, so I want to kind of walk you through. And the first thing that I have is Sheree models looks great, bitch. I don't know what the fuck these models were when Kenya was doing her little, uh, her and Rowan was doing they, they little, um, you know, check out with, with. Well, she said her. she hadn't hired real models yet, so these are the real models. Hey. Hi. Thank you. Lovila is someone that Rowan found. I want to see these walks. I want to see all that lady and the guys. She knew exactly the type of models that we needed, and she's actually saving the day. So okay. I don't have all of my samples. I'm still expecting another package. But uh, who did have some real models is Cynthia. Cynthia has some real models, bitch. Right? Right. When Cynthia did her model search, she really had real models. Um, and K-Roll was fine as fuck, too. What, uh, what the hell? <laughs> quiet on the set. Quiet on the set. What is going on? Oh, don't do it. Don't oh, do it. No. Oh, my God. <laughs> Wait. What is this? Why you got my son up here naked? Hey, he's in a photo shoot. You got baby oil on the boy chest. That's uh -huh. sweat. Okay, let me move Um, People are really coming through for Sheree, though. Uh, she's named a lot of people, and a lot of people are really coming through for her. Uh, one of the girls just said she will fly That was Rowan. Rowan, right. She'll fly somewhere for uh, Sheree um, and try to make it back today. If it's held anywhere in the U.S., I will fly over there today and go grab them. Well, you gonna help him finish making the stuff? Oh, no. I have five pieces. I'm still waiting on 19 more, but it's really not looking so good right now. You think we can do at least 15, 16 minutes? I said, well, damn, Rowan, she is the uh, assistant to have, ain't she? Sure, right smart my ass gonna say, well, you gonna help us sort the clothes too? Cause they ain't done. Oh, <laughs> I'm not sure. You get your ass back there and sort the goddamn clothes. Okay. Get some hands, bitch. Get some hands. Come on now. It does not seem that like 200 chairs. This is the hottest ticket in town. Every time I turn around, someone wants to bring a plus one or to be added to the list. It's not even on the list. Hey. Sheree says she she has 19 pieces. She ordered 19 pieces, but she only has five. So she explains again that she only has five pieces. She does not have 19 pieces like she ordered. Because that, yeah, we could pull that off and yeah. that would be considered a fashion show. But if it's less than that, Sheree, it's going to be Then a it's show. a preview and we don't even need the runway. How about that? Oh my God, this is a lot of pressure, you guys. We need to make um, now I'm on Apollo in the motherfucking building with his fine oh. pucker up lips ass. Apollo. Yes. Really? I'm sorry, I gotta make sure I look good for Apollo. 
You can dance, but please don't put your paws on Apollo. Make sure she's happy, because I'm going to be basically pulling you and telling Apollo. you where to go. Okay, here's our Apollo. <laughs> How is everybody? So we're just going through uh, the uh, walkthrough. At this point, I'm doing all that I can. The clothes. Um, so, um, all the, Apollo comes in, he's speaking to the girls like he Mr. Cool, like he, um, um, what you call that? What you call the man? Uh, Cartoon Network, Bravo. What was his name? Johnny Bravo. Johnny Bravo. Like, yeah, baby. What's up, baby? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, little lady. Do you mind? You're in my way. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Say, uh, you smell. That's how you doing it, like. And he is, cause everybody wanted to fuck Phaedra's husband. Oh my damn. And then I'm like, hey, Callie, Callie in the building. We'll never see uh, Callie and her roots look good. She ain't got a nappy root in the top of her head. You can follow me. But anyway, the girl, uh, Kayla. Yeah. Bitch, you know, the hoes are like, uh, uh, I'm ripping people in the audience. Then I got the one the one girl named Kayla. And the other girl, I forgot this whole head. I forgot this whole name because she's so bald head, bitch. She shouldn't even have the name. Follow me, camera. You can follow me. But anyway, the girl, uh, Kayla. Bitch, because they say I got mad. Yeah, I did get mad. I got mad because for the simple fact is, bitch, I'm on a show, bitch, I'm messing my head, first of all, my name is bigger than yours, you bald head, picky head, <laughs> purple looking bitch, bitch, you probably suck dick to got on the show anyway, oh. you know what I'm saying, you all sucking dicks to, to get comedian jobs, bitch, out of here, bitch, Miss Keller, and is she from the Iberville, bitch, I can tell, cause she had a nappy root at the top of her head, not from the project too. Oh, bitch. wait, I know Keller. Keller, yeah. Cat the daughter? Cat the daughter, yeah, we used to be coming by our house. Oh. But anyway, so, uh. She don't have one. That's really good, Callie. Kayla, Callie. Those are out of my hands. I can't sew. Hey, Callie. Oh, Apollo. <laughs> are you about to rehearse the ending or yes. we're doing a whole walkthrough again? A whole walkthrough. Mail. What else we need? Okay, so let's see. So Tyrone walks in this motherfucker and she got the girls, all the girls, bitch, gagging, bitch. No, she. Oh, oh I didn't mean to call him a she. I'm not Gary. See, Gary called everything with a she. Wig and stuff, mm, honey. You look nice. I you can't wait to nice. hurry up and get out of this bitch, cause honey, driving me. Gary, crazy. you know you about to go get in your no, car, you put crazy. the top. Um, everything is she. Um, no. Tyrone walks in and Sheree is what I was trying to say, is gagging. She's like, Mel, what else we need? Okay, so let's see. <laughs> Tyrone? Are you kidding me? Bitch. Not you. How the fuck you get the ankle bracelet off and get to Atlanta? You couldn't show up to the goddamn table, but you could show up here. You couldn't show up to the table in the state that you were currently in, but you could get that goddamn shit off your ankle and get your ass all the way to Atlanta. How? How, nigga? Because you a schemer, you a scammer. Hey, bitch, when did it become a black issue? How long have you known Tyrone? It doesn't matter. I'm just making a point. What's your point? You didn't know Tyrone, but you've known me. And you just decided to take what Tyrone said and believed it now. Just believed it. <laughs> you know I had to pull up on you. Oh, my goodness. Okay. <laughs> So in lieu of what he just said, Tyrone shows up and Sis says she was coming to read a bitch on camera. Okay. <laughs> right. And Apollo messy ass brought him. That's right. what I think. How you gonna have models and not get me in there? Oh Lord. Okay. Why is Tyrone walking in here looking like bruh man from the fifth floor? Okay, well we should probably need to have a conversation. <laughs> so how's everything going? You tell me. I am birds of a feather steal together. <laughs> Felons of a feather rock right. together, bitch. <laughs> you know Nene Leaks, and he was like, "Do I know Nene Leaks? I know Nene Leaks." What? <laughs> he he said, "I know Nene Leaks back from when she used to be a booster." Okay, and so I ain't saying it's true. I ain't never lived in Athens. I ain't never been there. But there's a gentleman, and I'm not gonna say his name because my friend go with him or whatever. But he was like, "I know Nene Leaks back from when she used to be a booster." So I mean, Nene, how is it that you know Tyrone? You saying you know the con artist? We know stripping in your past. Somebody that said boosting was in your past. You roll with Mar. Birds of a feather tend to steal together or whatever. Um, Let me say that now, okay? But I say Sheree should have cussed Tyrone the fuck out. Instead of acting surprised, I would have just gave him a straight up cuss out. Get the fuck up out of here. Would have went ham. My bun would have been coming apart just like Nene shit. Yes, yes, That's you what did. you do. How do we get here? I mean, we were having 
so much fun but all of a sudden and these buns falling down and it's like a full on war right now. Poor shit. Sheree had a confessional and she said something so funny. This bitch called him throwback Tyrone, bitch. Sheree throws shade, okay? She always coming in third place. She ain't never came in first, but the bitch throws shade. You know nothing. Pause and you let mom, me but I there? apologize for something that you did to go help me go back to prison. That's not gonna happen. Help you. I was humiliated. Throwback Tyrone is acting a plum fool in front of all these people. Yo, thirsty ass wanna be on camera. You're not the guy for me at all. The fact that he came in with this pimp walk is just killing me. Like his, oh, right. he rehearsed that walk in the mirror a few times, a few times. He wanted to walk down the runway. He was hoping Sheree was gonna get his son to put on real quick and walk him down the runway. You know I had to pull up on you. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, Apollo speaking to Tyrone as if. He didn't invite this man. I'm like, nigga, you invited him. Why the fuck is you acting like you? You don't know if he damn invited this man. Sheree said that she cool with his cousin or something, and she was the one that invited him. I am very close to Tyrone's cousin Stan. I invited Stan to the show. It's gonna be Fashion Week in Atlanta, boo. You know I need you to be there. So I'm thinking that's how Tyrone knew I was here. So you just pop up. I'm here. And when I was in your city, you couldn't pop up. Come on now. Not why I'm on federal home confinement. Yeah. Ain't nobody told Stan to tell his ass to come on down here. Then Apollo had a, um, a confessional to talk shit um, about Tyrone. He ain't um, see that, so he ain't gonna put it. He gonna, mean he gonna see it later, but. What? I ain't do nothing. I showed and licked my tongue out at Apollo. That's what I didn't do. Please don't put your balls on Apollo, because I'm gonna have an issue with that. What happened? It's called That's communication. You never Commun told me I that. did communicate. So why are you here today? No remorse, no apology, no nothing. Pause if you let me I apologize for something that you did to go help me go back to prison. That's not going to happen. Help you. This man has really lost his... Throwback Tyrone is acting a plum fool in front of all these people. Okay. Yo! Thirsty ass, want to be on camera? Okay. You're not the guy for me at all. I don't want you here. If you cannot tell me, if you can I apologize to me... not Apollo all up. Not, not, not Sheree all up in his you. motherfucking face like she ready to throw them bowls, bitch. Right. And Apollo looking like he ready to back her ass up. And Callie too, bitch. Callie like, bitch, I got a shank in my pocket. And I got a shoulder like my mama, bitch. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> a, a mean right hook like Candace <laughs> here. This is definitely a side of Drew I haven't seen. And especially as to get into Sheree's face. I wouldn't get in Sheree's face. That's just, just the wrong person to put your hand in their face. Then you hear that she got a strong right hook. Girl, and I got strong in everything. I'm not about to use it from my door. Definitely don't hold your apology. This nigga got life all the way spent around, just like he's spinning around in circles like a goddamn <laughs> GTA um, cartoon character. Uh, Grand Theft Auto cartoon character, bitch. He done went in circle. Look at Callie, how she's smiling. Can I tell me? And you can I apologize to me if, like, you ain't did nothing I wrong. Do, I'm not going back to prison. So I'm not about to do from my door. Definitely don't owe you an apology. Hi, I'm Callie. Nice to meet hey, you. Hey, Callie. How you doing? Congratulations, bro. Thanks. You, 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 What's your name? Tyrone. What's happening, bro? You in the, you he done went in circles. That's don't what know he what to do. Like. He got his mind fucked up like his legs fucked up, nigga. You don't think you owe her an apology. You got life all the way spent, spun around. You didn't nigga. even answer the phone. You didn't even answer the phone, nigga. You owe her 100%. You owe her an apology, nigga. Who the fuck is you to think you don't owe her no apology, nigga? You owe her an apology, you bitch ass, whack ass, nigga. And you find a little bit. <laughs> but still, you owe her an apology, nigga. You look like you'd be Cali Daddy. Bob is Kelly's daddy. Mm -hmm. well. But um, <laughs> he do look like he could be kin to her, like her ankle or something. Huh? Kelly, like, are you my daddy? Uh-uh. Stop. Ooh, that's pretty. Those are my kids. Hello, everybody. Now, children, what do you say when you meet a nice man? Are, are you my daddy? daddy? Um, so, look like Sheree had a package arrive while they're in the middle of arguing, and she's like, look, I ain't sending that goddamn package. The ass want to be on camera. You're not the guy for me at all. I don't want you here. If you cannot tell me, if you can right, apologize you. to me, if like you ain't did nothing right, wrong. You, I'm not going back to prison. So I'm not about to do something from my door. Definitely don't owe you an apology. Hi, I'm Callie. Nice to meet hey. you. Hi, I'm Callie. Nice to meet hey, you. Hey, Callie. How you doing? Congratulations, she, Thanks. What's your name? Tarun. What's happening, bro? You're in the, you're in the... What? Yeah, I'm good. Good to see you, bro. Kind of, you know, hear your, hear your situation, your plight and whatnot. But, you know, as a friend, you know what I'm saying? Me, me and Sheree, we've been friends for, you know, right. well over 10 plus years. Shane, at the right. end of the day, what's right's right. You don't leave your queen nowhere. I right. attended it. Tell you what's all right, bro. Maybe. You know what I mean? like, okay. I wasn't getting the middle okay. of you. Okay. Okay. Tyrone claims he uh, didn't show up because filming would be a parole take, violation. Take it outside That's of not true. Stolen. 
Because I, I think it's under subsection your, 32, your girl, so and it says that everyone has a right to media contact back. and our presence. So I'm not buying that one. You need help. Tyrone is telling told Apollo like, nigga, look, don't don't check me right now. Don't check me. Sandy, bro. You're in a, you're in a, what? Yeah, I'm good. Just see you, bro. Kind of, you know, hear your, hear your situation, your play and whatnot. But, you know, as a friend, you know what I'm saying? Me, me and Sheree, we've been friends for, you know, right. well over 10 plus years. Right. At the end right. of the day, what's right's right. You don't leave your queen nowhere. I right. attended it. I'm taking the wrong side, bro. Maybe. Maybe. Okay. I wasn't getting a little okay. you. Okay. And I feel Tyrone because I do feel that Apollo is fake. I feel Apollo is being trying to be messy. He trying to show off for the cameras and do too much. Because if you bout that life, then check him off camera when y'all were in prison because y'all was in prison together y'all made an announcement and it got out why y'all were in prison that y'all were in prison together we ended up finding out that y'all had made contact with right. each other y'all were cool apollo is trying to do that messy ass shit now i'm not on uh tyrone's side at all i don't like tyrone because of what he's done to sheree and i love sheree but apollo in this moment i feel tyrone don't try to check me right now bro because you're trying to show out for the cameras that's all. But He's Tyrone to is showing out for, out for the, the camera. camera. Yes, he is. Tyrone trying to show out for the camera too. So I guess Apollo give him a taste of his own medicine. This is the house husbands of Atlanta right about now. And quiet as it's kept, honey, I thought this was the real housewives of Atlanta, not the damn real washed up football players that's trying to get on the show. Like Chuck, if you want to hold a piece, Chuck, do your arm like this and tilt your head to the side. Better yet, bitch, you know the only men for housewives of Atlanta is wear heels, honey. Get it to Miss Derrick J and Miss Lawrence. So if you really want to be on the show, you need to just go ahead and drop my knee because she boring as fuck and call Derek. I'm going to get a pair of red bottles and put it. doesn't work that way. Well, why wouldn't you tell me that? I'm in Philly all the time. I'm coming there. We're going to restaurants. What are you talking We're about? Not going there. We're not going there and publicizing it. What do you mean publicizing cannot... it? You wasn't saying you was taping? You wasn't saying that you was You knew I was taping. You was coming to New York? I got approved for that. We so, understood okay, that. Okay, this is the understanding so that, that I don't need. This is my stuff. They got this stuff. Do you think? It looks nice, though. This is coming along. Thank you. I'm trying. And yes. you still don't think you owe me an apology to me? And we can both apologize to each other. I'm wrong? Absolutely you're wrong. You've got to be kidding me. Now, you about to piss me off. You've okay, got God, to be listen, kidding me. Okay, exactly. You don't care, so why are you here? My friend, because I can't be here. If you don't feel like you owe me nothing, Tyrone, you don't, don't need you, to be here tomorrow. I don't, I don't okay, well, you, you don't need to be here tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You don't need to be here tomorrow. Bye-bye. Tyrone can kick mother rocks. Why would I there? apologize for something that you did to go help me go back to prison? That's not going to happen. Help you. I was f***ing humiliated. Throwback Tyrone is acting a plum fool in front of all these people. Yo, thirsty ass want to be on camera? You're not the guy for me at all. I don't want you here. If you cannot tell me, if you can I apologize to me, if like you ain't did nothing I wrong. Didn't, I'm not going back to prison. So I'm not about to do this in front of my daughter. I 100 percent agree with Sheree. Um, you owe her an apology. She don't owe you no apology. Uh, you need to give her her apology. And she kicked his ass right the fuck up out of there. Bye. Let's see if she's going to And uninvited his ass. Yep, and uninvited him. Let's see if he'll be there tomorrow. Let's see if he'll be there tomorrow. You've got to be kidding me. Okay, exactly. You don't care for you here. My friend, because I can't be here. If you don't feel like you owe me nothing, Tyrone, you don't need to be here tomorrow. Okay, well, you don't need to be here tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You don't need to be here tomorrow. Bye-bye. Tyrone can kick mother rocks. Did he leave? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, f that. You, feel, you don't feel like you owe me an apology? Nothing? Get the f out of here. I know you tired of being embarrassed. You embarrassed, you're right. I know you so tired of being embarrassed. But I'm not the source of your embarrassment, honey. It's your materialism and your constant pursuit of trying to be all that that's the source of your embarrassment. But girl, fuck you. Get you I don't fuck around and got mad all over again, okay? Let me tell you something. Let me let me give you a piece of advice. You know the, the way Wendy Williams be giving people advice? Like, girl, I ain't gonna no shade, Sheree. You cute, but you not that goddamn cute. Get up, get out, and get something, okay? Like, girl, what the fuck is really wrong with you? Wake up. Quiet as it's kept, I really feel bad for your children and more importantly, your daughter because they're growing up in an environment where they think that the way you think is okay. I don't know. Sheree, get your priorities together, mama.
Uh, who was this wonderful person that was given a fashion show with no fashions? How dreadful. <laughs> <laughs>